This December, negotiators from 195 countries will meet in Paris to reach the first ever Universal Climate Agreement. Done right, this agreement will drive ambitious action to protect people and the planet for decades to come. The good news? The world is already moving toward a strong low-carbon economy. Governments are making more commitments to slow climate change. Investments in renewable wind and solar energy are soaring. Companies are aligning their business practices to create profits and follow the science. These actions are promising, but they are not enough. In Paris, country leaders need to come together and take bold steps to accelerate the transition to a clean economy. The Paris Agreement can do that in three ways. First, it must have long-term mitigation and adaptation goals so that our destination is clear. We need to phase out greenhouse gas emissions as soon as possible in the second half of this century in a way that is fair and equitable. And we need to help vulnerable countries cope with climate impacts. Second, the agreement must ensure countries are open and transparent about their actions and publicly evaluate their progress. Third, the agreement must make sure that countries increase their efforts on a regular basis, at least every five years, to slash emissions, build resilience to climate impacts and provide financial support to drive climate action. We can only tackle climate change if we keep strengthening our efforts. Countries need to agree to ramp up their actions in Paris and again in 2020. Technology is constantly improving. Countries' actions need to keep pace. Leaders of business, government, civil society and faith are calling for climate solutions. It's time to accelerate the transition to a clean economy, prepare communities for climate impacts and ensure all countries have the resources necessary to mobilize investment towards a zero carbon and resilient future. The Paris Climate Summit will be a turning point in how the world responds to this global crisis. World leaders need to come together for a safer and more prosperous planet. 2015 is the year to deliver the first Universal Climate Agreement.